Sterling Single 12, also known as Emma Green in real life, is a Thomas and Friends animatic maker, as opposed to Montagu GWR's more mimetic animations. She started her career in 2007, a year before Montagu GWR's debut on YouTube. She is an 18-year-old woman and grew up with Thomas and Friends, with her favorite character being Emily. Her persona was a humanized version of Emily with dark skin and long black hair, befitting the shape of the area around Emily's face, and emerald green attire consisting of a jacket and pants, along with a black hat bearing a gold top. She was especially well known for her animatic of Thomas the Tank Engine's first Series 7 episode, Emily's New Coaches, titled, Emily's New Coaches Humanized, with her persona driving a Sterling single and her other humanized versions of the engines driving the other engine classes they are based on in the original show. This was her first and most popular video, and she kept getting popular with every animatic she posted. When 2008 came, Montagu GWR made his YouTube debut and expressed interest in collaborating on an animation with Emma. With Emma's artistic prowess and Tom's audio files of moments from the show, they made their first meme animatic with their respective personas, and both posted it on their channels. The animatic was various moments from Thomas and Friends's model era with the engines being assholes to each other, but humanized. When Tom posted Puff Cycle in 2009, Emma began worrying about Tom's mental health and told him to take a break. They had a collaboration planned that day, but Emma postponed it so Tom could take a break from YouTube and take some time off. When she checked on him, the comments section on Puff Cycle was full of comments from viewers spamming, do things the great western way, and speculated the spam comments were taking a toll on Tom. Emma's speculation was proven true as Tom's mental health was indeed deteriorating. Tom's upload schedule slowed down drastically during 2011, so Emma decided to leave Tom alone to see if he was getting better, but she never realized what was going on behind the scenes. Emma took a one-year hiatus to give herself and Tom a break. When 2011 came, Emma called Tom to see if he was up for their planned collaboration, but when she contacted Tom, he said, I must do things the great western way or else they'll hurt me worse than yesterday. Tom's voice was frantic and nervous as she spoke. This raised Emma's concerns and she asked him what was going on, but he just hung up on her abruptly. Emma had a hard time contacting Tom after, and when she saw his newly uploaded video, Karma, she was horrified. Tom posted a picture of his parents' dead bodies in his video after enduring their abuse. After the first call regarding their collab, Emma contacted Tom over Skype to check up on him. The transcript has been archived in text, as no audio files have been found. Emma, Tom? Are you there? Can you hear me? We need to talk. Tom, holding a knife and facing away from the camera. Why hello Emma. I was just finishing up some things with my parents. Emma, this isn't funny Tom. Tell me why you're holding a knife. Tom, I was just playing a board game with them. I think dad's winning. Pans the camera to the corpses of his parents, which were positioned to look like they were playing a board game. Emma, almost puking at the gruesome scene. Tom, what the actual fuck? What did you do? Tom, oh, but they are just sleeping. They had a very long day and fell asleep, right at the table. Emma, I'm not falling for that Tom. Whether you were abused or not, murder is not justifiable. Tom, grinning. Well, would you like to join them? They're happy to see you. Say hello dad. Holds father's arm and waves hand. Emma, no no. What the fuck man? You should have called the police. Tom, sighing. My parents always did things the wrong way, so I simply taught them the great western way. Karma sure hits hard, doesn't it? Ends the call. Tom's channel was deleted in 2012. When Emma went to visit Tom in 2013, he looked like he hadn't slept in days. Emma told Tom that he should have called the police on his parents instead of resorting to murder, but when confronted, Tom pulled out the same knife he used to kill his parents and pointed it at Emma's throat, before going back to staring at the two corpses he sat down at the table. As of 2023, Emma has settled down and is currently living alone in England. She occasionally had to deal with one of her fans, but as her fans kept loitering around her house, she called the police and filed restraining orders against each of them. 
Emma's channel, Sterling Single 12, was deleted from YouTube by her own accord, as she moves away from her rough history with Tom. Tom has been missing since 2022, and nobody knows where he is now.